I think that fashion, when it's, it's, it's done right, it makes you feel more confident, um, lifts your spirits, and if you feel overwhelmed, you put on the right thing and suddenly, you know, you're in a different mood. I redesigned, I didn't do it from scratch, I remodeled my mother's second wedding dress for her second wedding. Wow, at what age? I was five. No. Her dress was not working out, so I helped her and uh, I think we made quite a few good improvements. Were you allowed to use scissors? Or did, do you have those little kid scissors? No, I sat at her fitting and I told them, do this, do that. And, it's astounding, but she listened to a five-year-old, so the dress turned out pretty well. But now I'm amazed who would listen to a five-year-old, but she did. <laughs> jumpsuit print and it looks just like I wear today halter v-neck pajama pants it was great so you developed your signature style at 15 I haven't changed I'm boring <laughs> Ironically, the first thing I ever made was using newspaper taped together to make a jacket when I was uh, in high school. So I've almost come back full circle then. That's amazing. And did you do anything with that? Were you? Um, I don't think I really had it completely organized well enough for it to be um, worn properly and it being out of paper and scotch tape. Um, but I was very excited that I had constructed something.
remember the very first thing you ever designed? Maybe something you drew when you were a child? Design for the clothes. Yes, either just a drawing or something you actually made in school. Oh, in the school, in, in the first day I was in uh, fashion school, the assignment is gingham check. And then I have to make uh, what God's dress. So that is, I think, first my uh, what, uh, what assignment. And but, uh, what, when I was a student, my sister came from uh, Japan and for wedding in California. So I made her wedding dress. Yeah, that's also kind of memorable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.